Hi everyone, it's Barb Marion here today. I want to talk to you today about um, doing solo ads. Um, solo ads, you know, in case you're just wondering what is a solo ad, it's just a way to get someone to mail your offer to their list. And you pay them, you know, to deliver X number of clicks, you know, to your offer. This is usually um, an opt-in page where you collect subscribers, you know, and if it's done right, you can build your list, you know, very fast. But there's a few things to keep in mind when you're doing solo ads, and that's uh, keep it small. Don't buy, you know, buy your ads in small chunks because most of the people over deliver on their ads. So in the long run, instead of buying like a thousand clicks, and getting a 10% over uh, click rate, you will get, you know, buy smaller ones like 50 or 100 clicks. And when, if you were to get the 10% or, you know, in those, you're going to end up with actually more in, in the long run because usually they will go over that 10% that they usually talk about. So, um, just don't spend thousands of dollars, you know, trying out solo ads because you don't know how you know how these people are for their ads so when you're doing testings do small testings with that and make sure that your squeeze page is is a really good um, attention grabber squeeze page that they will really want to get more information on once they've clicked and opened that um, don't expect your solo ad lists to convert like a regular list. You know, one thing I noticed was, you know, the fact that my solo ad list, you know, didn't convert as well as my regular lists did. And, you know, unless you're doing detailed testing, you know, there's no way to know for sure um, what to, you know, how to determine why that is. Um and maybe because some solo lists that you're sending to might be just wanting free offers if you're trying to sell something then it's just not going to convert as good so it's all in the testing and a good idea would be to email your you know solo person that you're going to buy from and do a good question you know ask them questions you know how do their opt in you know rates you know what are their opt-in rates um, what are their open you know click rates do they respond to just say if you're in in BIM or in power network do they respond to you know these type of uh, emails do they you know do you have a list that actually purchased you know products if you're you know selling something so make sure you uh, email your solo ad provider and and just be you know frank and open with the questions because you're the one paying the money so you don't want to waste you know your hard-earned money so I just want to say you know solo ads are a great way to get those subscribers and I would just recommend just keep them small you know in small little packs try different people just tweak things in your ads and um, you will do just fine so as, as I say that, uh, if you want to know more about Empower Network or Big Idea Mastermind, then just click the link below and um, I'll see you on the other side.